Love it. This is your sister and time voice. We are on all social media platforms. Follow us and do uh, some activity on the platform. God richly bless you. The video you are watching was taken from uh, or recorded in Uganda, one of Africa country, and it's about coronavirus death. The Lord has revealed a true or a mystery about the coronavirus. These people in the in the terms of the government some of the government and some of the doctors and some of the hospitals worldwide some of them are burying empty coffin with that body so if you send your family to your family member to uh, i mean a hospital and the doctor will tell you that the person has the true coronavirus they, and as we all know, coronavirus disease, they don't give the body to the family. The government will take everything and they will bury. Not knowing that these people are burying empty coffee without any body in it. So these people were enforced that uh, they are enforcing these people to open the coffin for them to see what is in the coffin. So this was the secret the Lord by the grace has revealed to us about the coronavirus. So the people are insisting that they should bar they should open the coffin. They opened the coffin and the coffin was empty. It was empty. So uh, you can ask, where is the uh, the person that maybe they say end time voice is dead through coronavirus? They will not give my body to my family. They will not give their body to my relative. But they say the government will bury their body. So where are those people? Where are those people? If they are not in the coffin, where are they? Now, let's go to our main topic today. Our main topic today is about a uh, seed. The people say, you see, there's empty coffin. So, where is the body? Who, where is the relative or the family member you claim that they are dead? <laughs> May God have mercy on this wicked generation. They do everything for money. So, you encounter about billions of people. They say they are dead. They are dead. They are dead. And the bodies, they always bury empty coffee. Why are those people? Are they the people they use for ritual? Are they the people they sell them? Are they the people they... May only God know where those people are. May God have mercy on this generation. Today, our main topic is dead. Beloved, as a Christian, as a Christian, always work with your salvation with fear and trouble because after death there is a judgment after death and i want to say that in every moment or every day every day we call it a day work out your salvation or live your life as to that day or today is the last day for you on earth because death has no respect for anybody we are going to show a couple of people on this video in this video that we were with them or they were with us and now we see them no more we see them no more so you have to compare it to our life how we live our christian life i mean our our righteous and holiness left in the sight of God, not in the sight of man. You would dress properly, you would dress modestly, but in your heart it is full of uh, something we can't mention. May God have mercy on us. So we are talking about um, death. Death has no respect. Death has no respect. The Bible makes it understand, make us understand that. It has appointed for every mind to die. And after the, die, uh, the, the, the death, there is a judgment. So live your life according to the words of God so that you will give good accounts. Uh, 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 quite long ago, our sister, very talented lady, Ebony, a very beautiful lady, just passed away through car accident. And he, she is going to make an account or give an account to her maker. So what account, if it were you, what account are you going to give to your maker? Let's copy or no, I'm sorry for that. Let's learn something from everything that happened. This is a beautiful sister and very talented Ghanaian musician. May her soul rest in peace. And the rest in peace, I told you, there is too many different. And now, let's go to the slave queen. This sister you are watching.
watching her die through Richard's boyfriend. Rest in peace. This also died through. Mother sister to visit her friend's grave and she passed out. This sister too did the surgery of she won big bottles and through that she lost her life. This sister too, the next sister you're about to watch also was having a problem with her private part. And this sister also was a slave queen. These people died young before their age. May God have mercy on this generation. And this one, the website said this was was overdose and she died. True accident, this slave queen died. After this one, she also was twerking for her boyfriend that she had mysterious uh, accident and she lost her life. Tr slave queen this is Amma after twerking on stage on naked she lost her life this is the vice president the late vice president of ghana he lost his life so you should be very careful of our life because after the after the death you have an account to give to your maker the late tb joshua a very popular prophet in nigeria as you all know, this is Captain Maswood. He was murdered through a small village called, let's put it there. He lost his life. We are showing you all these people for you to know that they were with us. This is the former president of Ghana. He loses his life. And then next, the late former president, John Jelly Rawlings. We are showing you all this to you guys for you to know that they were with us. Everyone you see her or him on this video, in this video, the person has passed out. So compare it to yours. The arrow showing you this is a young gay, a JHS student, mysteriously lost his life. So as a Christian, live your life in a day like the that day or today is the day the last day on earth and work out your salvation with fear and trouble don't compare your life to anybody you came alone and you will live alone brothers and sisters death is rare and heaven is real hell too is real be careful with your life how you live your life this is the uh, unknown body these people this the, the video you are watching the, they are dead body in a mortuary and they don't have owner this body have no you see you see it is it, like firewood it's not firewood they are like me and you they were like us you see it it's not a firewood though. it's a human being they have no owner so they, they have to do a mass barrier to dig a big hole and put all of them in it and bury them if you are part of these people please what account are you going to give it to your maker this is your sister and time voice i'm shouting and giving you the sign of enter so that you can prepare righteously holiness way very perfect life live your life blameless as your follow as your as you as as the christ you are following this is a body this is a body she she is like me he was like you but now they have turned to firewood they have no owner prepare yourself for everything the slave queen you just watched them they die they die through money so my brother, my sisters, I have nothing to say, but I'm reminding you that you have a journey to go and that journey has no return. That journey has no return as they are throwing your, your colleague as a firewood in a mass barrier or in a dig hole. Please make your life or live your life as a stranger on this earth. It has a, it's appointed for a man to die. And after the death, there is a great judgment before you. Don't allow anybody to tell you that there is no... After you die, that is all. 
you will be live your life like those people saying one safe is forever safe who told you her uh, sin would take someone to hell why is it that jesus has died and blah 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 don't follow such people the day you will you will cross your eyes and you can't open your eyes there you will see that mm, some people have lied to you please be very careful with your life because one day one day you will be no more one day one day i will be no more one day one day someone will post your picture or do a video about you and they you they will start tapping rest in peace rest in peace rest in peace meanwhile you are resting in punishment i recommended you that you will rest in peace rather than resting in punishment beloved god loves you so much he has a place that he has prepared for you to spend your eternity don't waste your life on unnecessary things don't waste your life on something that does not benefit you anything that does not profit your soul is bogus be careful with your life live your life according to the words of god be very careful how you talk be very careful the friends you move with because the video you watch see the slave queens these people that true friends did that i want to visit my friend my my sakawa boy called me how will you know that the guy you are living or the guy you are dating or as you call it, going out with him is an rituals he he has been doing rituals internet frosted please stay away with friends have only one friend have only one friend that is jesus and the words of god there is no other friend like such man because a time is coming when you are going you will go alone the slave queens you you will watch their pictures or their video i show you beloved they were like you they were like you most of them are living their life they are living expensive life teenagers 18 20 23 because of money they have died before their age so i'm pleading in the name of our lord jesus christ please make live your life like you are you are you are a stranger i think the video has ended but it has not yet end this is the first badge did you count them um numbers of people in this Oh my goodness, they are like firewood. You see, one day, one day, you will be like this. One day, one day, you will be like the disciples are don't have owner. This dead body don't have owner. They have been being they have been in the mortuary for so many years, and they have turned to firewood. So they have to show them like this. I'm not showing this for you to feed bad, not to eat. But I'm showing you that one day, one day, you will be like this. One day, one day, you will be like this. One day. One day. Because the age of every man is numbered, according to the book of Job. It's numbered. And there is a boundary ahead of you, or a line ahead of you. When it reach your turn, you can't do anything about it. This is the body. This is a human being like you and I. But now, they are throwing them like, <laughs> like a, 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 a mason building and they are throwing mortar for them to build their house. My goodness. This is a living being. And they have not turned to body. They don't have owner. So all this is what they can do to maintain their as you see this is the body turned to uh to bones because this is not body again and these people they are so have left this body the moment they die 
they are there now they have they have seen either they are they are resting in peace or they are resting in punishment may god have mercy may god have mercy it's very sad so don't boast about your righteousness stay away or be very vigilant about self-righteousness self-righteousness have taken most or have deceived many christian self-righteousness have deceived many christian self-righteousness i address modesty i don't put this on me i don't put, but if you go into that person heart you will see that it's better for her or him to dress half naked than putting on that long garment and in the heart she or he is half naked she or he is half naked please don't be deceived by your dressing don't be deceived by the church you go don't be deceived by the position you have don't be deceived about the things you see the the, the, the position you have in church because one day one day someone will sit on your grave like this they will sit on your grave someone will say i you are, are you my size do you know the kind of car I, 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 I ride? The kind of car, this is your size. The kind of expensive things you have, this is your destiny. No matter how rich you are, you will be in this country. The country called Simon Tree. Simon Country. Ha <laughs> ha. Here is your destination. So don't boast about yourself. Don't boast about it. Call every day a lucky or a second chance day. These people are all buried. Some are there for so many years. They are like me and you. But now, they are nowhere to be found. Some, were, some of them were rich. Some, were, some of them were poor. Some of them were buried with gold money expensive clothes but all these are not necessary the most important part what account are you going to give to your maker what account are you going to give to your maker brothers and sisters the account is the most important thing the life after death is the most important thing. Life after death is the most important thing. But before that, I, I think it's not necessary. If you get what you eat, where you the what you wear, where you will sleep, let be content with such things and stop following money, money, money. Whilst the, the youth are dying in slave queen. I don't know who how and when this this slave queen things came about this is our people they are throwing them like a firewood you can't even identify them who is rich here this is your sister and voice 